Paid search versus organic search. Which is better? Search engine optimization, once an afterthought when compared to other marketing strategies, is now at the forefront of inbound marketing success. There are two ways to land yourself on the front page, which often confuses people. Paid search and organic search. Paid search and organic search are both viable ways to ensure that your company is one of the few that shows up at the top of your target keyword or market. But which is best? When comparing paid and organic search, instead of asking which is best, it may be wise to ask which is best for you. Both have unique advantages and disadvantages, so it's a matter of knowing which will work best to get you the most out of your marketing dollars. Organic search. Organic search results are the ones that appear below the ads. They naturally occur in the search results page because their content is relevant to the search term according to the search engine algorithm. And therefore, they organically add more value to the people that are searching for them. Here are some of the pros and cons of organic search. Pros. Trust. When you're searching for something on Google, which results are the most likely to select? The top ones undoubtedly, and that's because that's the searches we've grown to trust. This perception of credibility works well for your company if you're at the top of the results because most people are guaranteed to click through to your site. Long lasting. So long as your content remains relevant, your page is likely going to remain at the top, which simply means more beneficial exposure over the long period of time. You can think out of it as a set it and forget it kind of marketing plan because once you put in the effort and the resources up front, you never have to do it again, but you'll reap the benefits long term. Click throughs. If you're comparing the click through rate of organic versus paid searching, organic makes up nearly 68%, especially for buyers who have an interest but not necessarily an immediate purchase intent. Compounded ranking. Each time you rank high in the search engine results, you increase your chances of ranking high again. By ranking high, you not only build trust with users, but you also build a good reputation with the search engines. The more authority status the engine gives you, the higher you'll rank over time. Cons. Initial investment. At the heart of great organic search results is great content. Content can be anything from articles and white papers to videos and infographs, but the best content utilizes SEO tactics or search engine optimization tactics that can take some time to produce. Whether it's an internal staff or outsourcing contractor, someone will have to take the time to research and create the content, which means it will inevitably be a lofty investment. Time. On top of that, rank for highly competitive keywords can take months, even years. So there's a good chance your marketing team will be out of the while. If you're able to stick it out and see your efforts through to achieve high ranking, your return on investment is almost guaranteed. Paid search. In essence, paid search results are advertising for your company. Generally speaking, you associate ads with certain keywords. And when users search for those keywords, your ad displays at the top of the search results in the section marked as ads. If your users click on the listing, you pay a small amount, which is called PPC or pay-per-click advertising. The placement of your ad compared with your competitor's ad depends on the amount that each of you bid for a certain keyword, as well as a few other certain factors. The pros and cons of PPC advertising have some similarities and some differences of those of organic search. Pros Time Paid search rankings show at the top of the results as soon as you pay for the ad placement. You simply decide the keywords you want to rank for, the message you want your searchers to see, and to find the budget the search engine to work with. It's fast and it can be very effective. Success after click-through. Paid search is geared towards more serious and eager buyers. Though it accounts for much less search engine traffic than organic results, the actual revenue amount is quite considerable. Targeting. Paid search is tailored to reach certain audiences. So if your targeting is done correctly, you have a high chance of getting your message in front of the people that you want to see it. Not only can you target by keywords, but you can further filter into segments by location, marital status, education level, and much more. Cons. Cost. In general, PPC advertising can be quite costly for a few reasons. First, bid price is based on keywords, so the more competitive the keyword, the higher price you're going to pay on each click for your display ad. And paid search advertising requires a high level of expertise and understanding to be successful. So you either have to have a knowledgeable person on your team or outsource it. Short lived. As soon as you stop paying for your PPC ads, they go away. So they don't have the long term effect that organic searches will over time. Lack of trust. Drawing on the example of organic search results, users tend to select organic results before they'll click on the ads at the top of the page because there isn't the same level of trust. People know they're paid ads, so there may be a certain suspicion over how relevant the information might actually be. 
When it comes to best practices, generally a combination of organic and paid net the greatest results. Utilizing both ensures visibility and also increases credibility, secures everlasting search results, and targets buyers at multiple parts of the buying cycle. Mix and match how you utilize search for your marketing strategy. Make sure to track the results so you can improve things as you go and try new tactics if the current ones aren't working. Search engine optimization takes time and effort, regardless of which method you use, but the results are always worth it.